Hey guys, so today I just want to do a quick little uh, video here giving you a quick little phone advice. So, um, if I would like give you an advice of like my favorite phone right now to get, um, I would actually go with the Huawei Mate 9 over the uh, Galaxy S8. Even though I use the Galaxy S8 as my main phone, uh, I, I really, really do enjoy how kind of slim it is on the sides. But the, the, the thing that has been so frustrating for me with the Galaxy S8 is still, even with like 7 uh, or 800 megabyte updates that I've been getting to this device, even though Samsung has been sending it out, I still, and I, I also have uninstalled most of my games, so I barely even have any apps on this phone, but it still has these like major lag uh, slowdowns when I open up photos and things like that. I find it extremely frustrating. So I would actually say that the best phone to get right now, uh, I would actually go with the Huawei Mate 9. Uh, not the um, Mate 9 Pro. Uh, the Mate 9 Pro is, the problem with that one is it has the fingerprint sensor uh, on the front side. So it has it down here, uh, basically. And the problem with that is I think personally that this is just the best location ever uh, to have a fingerprint sensor. It's so natural. So that is, uh, that is pretty nice. I think actually it's the best phone to probably get right now uh, with its huge display. Now if you are into iPhones of course you do have the iPhone 7 Plus. The problem with this phone I think is it feels just too bulky, too huge and uh, right now we are very very close to be getting a more I think hopefully we're gonna feel a bit better more slimmed down like an iPhone 8 or um, with the, in the big display area we do have the Galaxy Note 8 coming up here very very soon which is also going to be extremely nice but I, I don't think it's good to get this one right now because you know you, we do have two big phones coming in which with major redesigns which is going to kind of resemble a little bit uh, the Galaxy S8 kind of design here with an amazing kind of edge to edge display uh, but um, yeah, I would recommend either, either the uh, Huawei Mate 9 here or wait for the iPhone 8 or for the Galaxy Note 8. The key thing with the Galaxy Note 8, which is gonna be extremely interesting to see is if they have solved the lag issues, uh, which I'm getting with this device. Uh, I really hope Samsung get the Note right and that it will be uh, have less lag than Galaxy S8. So quickly a video talking about that, hopefully you enjoyed and have a great day.